Finally, Disneyland has dropped the foodie guide for Halloween season at Disneyland Resort. Happy Halloween! Happy Halloween! Happy Halloween, everybody. Yeah, we're officially in the Halloween season. This is it. All right, so Disneyland, uh, I had a chance to skim over this. Wow, they outdid themselves. I just want to say incredible job to all the Disneyland team, chefs, creatives behind this. It's incredible. It's, it's literally incredible, this foodie guide. Uh, we're going to be going over, if not most of these items, and uh, I'll give my opinion. I love doing these. I know the community here at Five Fires loves when I do these. Uh, I've got the, I got like five messages in the morning like you better do a foodie guide video or or, or or like bonfire and I was like here it comes this is it this is it Michael Jackson um all right let's get into it so the foodie guide I'm really curious if there's a lot of returning things or new things and for the most part it seems like it's new stuff this is an article from Nicole. Foodies, it's time to grab your appetite and let the ghouls time roll because Halloween time is kicking off soon at Disneyland Resort, August 23rd. We're really not even that far away now. It's August 7th today. Ghostly goodies will materialize across the resort along with frightful fun and decor to get you in the spirit. Culinary teams will cast a spell on your taste buds with their ghostly delight. I always love the, 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 the way they, they say things in these things. This year, there are skeleton of new and returning bites that you won't want to miss from Delightful, uh, like the new Caramel Apple Cheesecake. What? And Jolly Holiday, the returning Ursula Shake from Shamoozies, to savory selections like the Villainous Double Cheeseburger and Smoke Jumper. Wow. They're trying to... I'm trying to go really hard here. Now let's see. Um, for a sweet twist on a classic attraction, drop in a haunted mansion where there's beloved happy haunts transformed the pumpkin him. Okay, we don't need to go over that. Uh, California Adventure festivities Dia de los Muertos with Plaza de Familia from August 23rd and November 2nd. Joyous Occasion features the love of family with unique fa uh, photo opportunities, memory wall, live performances of Pixar's Coco, and of course, delicious bites. Yeah, they gave us that foodie guide too. And uh, I posted it online and most people are like, they already have these things. <laughs> but uh, Paradise Garden Grill, they're still going to be serving some of these favorite treats. Uh, all the way to November 2nd, I guess. Their chata cheesecake. All right, let's keep it going. What are we looking at first? Halloween snacks at Disneyland. So we're going to start off with Disneyland before we go into California Adventure. Um, what kind of pizza are they creating? It seems like we always get a new pizza. Dark Matter Pizza. Sliced with celestial tomato sauce. Topped with mozzarella, mozzarella cheesy or cheese spice Italian sausage, roasted mushrooms, and black olives. Okay, I, I, that sounds good to me. So, Italian sausage and mushrooms? Psh, let's go. Uh, Alien Buzz macaroon filled with berries and cream. Ah, it's Buzz Lightyear. Okay. Okay, okay. Uh, they're also going to have a blush pasta apple pecan salad and that's alien pizza planet uh what do we got a sausage what is this what is this bingo barbecue wow we got like a, a coffee coming to bingo barbecue i don't ever recall a coffee at bingo barbecue <laughs> um Oh, no, no, okay, okay, okay. Bingo barbecue, hoopla wrap, wild boar sausage with a cucumber tomato salad, miso aioli with grilled lavish. So a hoopla wrap. 
I'm not gonna lie, that looks delicious. Uh, it's like almost refreshing in a way. Blue Bayou is going to have a pumpkin swirl cheesecake with spiced anglaise, chocolate crumb, and pecan tule. So, new dessert at Blue Bayou. Looks good. Definitely would try that. Cafe Daisy. Ah, that's where the cold brew's going. Daisy's Goody Goody Donuts. House-made mini apple cider donuts with spiced apple sugar, a caramel apple cold brew, cold brew with apple caramel syrups, whipped topping, caramel drizzle, cinnamon sugar, and an apple chip. Damn, sugar on sugar right there. Toontown Hall Harvest Hall Harvest pumpkin iced tea, sweet tea with vanilla and pumpkin spice syrup, whipped topping, caramel drizzle, cinnamon sugar. Wow. They don't have a picture of that one, but this is this is starting off strong. I like I like where they're going with this foodie guide. Um looks good. It looks good. Yeah, you had me a coffee. I need to sip my coffee. I keep forgetting I have a coffee. <sighs> keep forgetting. What's up, Kevo? Hey, say hi to me if you ever see me at the parks, man. Also, too, oh, man, I, for, I should have done this at the beginning because it's so deep in the live. Shout out to Paige. I had a chance to meet Paige and her family yesterday. So five fires of them. I know they're big Horror Night fans. Uh, pleasure meeting the Paige family yesterday. I just want to throw that out there. I hope she watches this. All right, Carnation Cafe. Spice chicken sandwich. We've, we've already had that. Spiced pickle lemonade. Tito's homemade vodka. I keep forgetting that Carnation Cafe has alcohol. I, like, I, all the sit downs have alcohol, I guess. Minute made lemonade pickle juice, sweet and sour, topped with Sprite and pickle spear. Why is Disney just. They're just shoving pickles into anything these days. They're like, we're going to put it. We're going to put it in drinks. Just put a pickle in it. Just put in pickles and drinks. <laughs> An El Elizan Brewing Night Owl Pumpkin L. Damn. And then a Spadden Oktoberfest Your Marzen. So, sounds like two new beers are coming to Carnation Cafe. What about these churros? What are we looking at here? Okay. Churros near Buzz Lightyear Astro Blaster. So that's Tomorrowland. A green apple churro with caramel sauce. Classic churro world in green apple sugar served with caramel dipping. That sounds wonderful. I'm guessing that's the green one right there. Uh, churros near Haunted Mansion. The bride churro is making his way back. The groom churro. Uh, and couple's first kiss, a side of strawberry sauce and wedding cake crumbles to top off your bride or groom churro. All right, all right. Uh, does any any fan favorites or any 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 fans of the groom and bride churros? Like, are those good? Are those good? What's up, Macy? Good morning. Fire it up! Hit the like button. Let's get a 200. I don't even. How many people do we got in here? I have to check. Uh, let me see. We got 300 people. Let's get 300 likes, everybody. And uh, we, got a, we got a lot of people on the Twitter sign, too. Thank you, all the people on the Twitter sign, for joining. We got 225 on the Twitter side. So thank you so much, everybody, for joining us in this beautiful morning. Uh, wow, look at this churro. There's a little bit of everything right here. Churro near Sleeping Beauty Castle. Maleficent churro. Classic churro rolled in chocolate cookie crumbs with peanut butter dipping sauce. This is the one I thought was very interesting. Yeah. I feel like a lot of videos have picked up on people buying like some type of meat and throwing it in this this pretzel right here this delicious pretzel <laughs> this thing is so good 
Um, Edelweiss and Snacks. Fantasyland Garlic Cheesy Brat. Hoo-hoo-hoo. Damn. Bratwurst in Cheesy Garlic Pretzel Bread. Uh, sign me up. That is a must. And churros are back. <laughs> Dude, Fantasyland Garlic Cheesy Brat. That, that, that's a must. Uh, I will for sure be getting that. Alpine Almond Delight. Rolled Danish filled with pastry cream. Almond cream finished with sliced almonds. Damn, those are those are great options for Edelweiss and snacks. Okay, okay, okay. Galactic Grill always bringing a new cheeseburger. They, they, they don't have a good record, in my opinion. The the cheese the, the burgers have been kind of uh, more miss than hit over there at Galactic Grill. Uh, let's take a read. What Darth Vader? Darth my chocolate coming back. Oh, damn, oh, damn, oh, damn. Ghost of Anaheim Burger. Angus Beef and Vegetable Patty. I'll tell you right now, that burger sucks. I'm not even going to keep reading that one. Pumpkin Pie Chai Tea. Iced Chai Tea topped with pumpkin pie cream. Uh, that sounds good. Acai Blueberry Smoothie. With acai, blueberries, banana, orange top with whipped cream and matcha, matcha powder. Darth by chocolate coming back. Nice. So, wow. Did, did it not talk about that coffee thing? Oh, no, that's the, that's the matcha thing. Okay, okay. All right, all right. I'm, I'm, I'm liking these treats. Gibson Girl Ice Cream Parlor Trailer. We got Rest in Peace Chocolate Sunday coming back strong. That Rest in Peace Chocolate Sunday, they could just bring that back for like the next 10 years. Everybody loves that one. Harbor Galley. Transylvania Transfusion. Dark Berry and Cherry Punch garnished with fresh berries. That sounds delicious. I definitely want to try that been very hot very hot at did it's gonna be very hot uh it's gonna be very hot in august and september so that's a great that's a great drink to know about uh jolly holiday look at this what is that oh like a bunt cake These flat things you know, these flat things never hit that hard. They, they, it's always appealing, like, oh, look at that. But I don't know. They just they just never hit hard. Very cute. Very cute stuff this year. Jack-o'-lantern Mickey Pumpkin Macaron. Oh, it's a macaron. No. I thought it was a whoopie pie or something. Uh, pumpkin macaron shell filled with caramel buttercream and pumpkin cheesecake. Absolutely delicious. I already know that. That's for sure. That's for sure good. Spiced bunt cake. Spiced cake filled with cream cheese frosting topped with purple glaze, sprinkles, and spice mousse with Mickey chocolate decoration. Caramel apple cheesecake. Caramel cheesecake with caramelized apple filling, green colored white chocolate mousse, chocolate flakes chocolate bat decoration and uh apple almond croissant apple stuffed croissant with almond topping hazelnut brownie tart with chocolate frosting hazelnut spread on a brownie filling f brownie filling topped with chocolate frosting and sprinkles so jolly holiday just bring in the fire just bring in the fire wow all right, all right, all right. Uh, what do we got here? Oh, more Jolly Holiday. Man, it keeps going? What is that? Pear black, Blackberry Cheesecake Crusada. 
fresh pears with New York cheesecake and blackberry jam in a pie crust top caramel. I think they have a picture of that. Bulgogi toasted sandwich with corn cheese soup. What? How is this not new? I, I didn't know this existed. I would have said this is new. Wow. A Bugogi. What a great name. That great name. Uh, marinated beef, grilled onion, mozzarella, kimchi aioli on a sourdough served with corn cheese soup. Sign me up. That sounds delicious. Pumpkin muffin top with cream cheese icing and then a Mickey bat cookie. So Jolly Holiday is definitely a great stop. You're looking for something Halloween. Uh, they, they got so much. Jolly Holiday Bakery. Just killing it. What the... F what in the Baba Freak is this thing? Hey, t t tell me that ain't a stomach ache right there. <laughs> uh, Little Red Wagon. Blue berry corn dog hand dipped corn dog topped with blueberry compote and bacon powdered sugar bacon powdered sugar what <laughs> I have a bad feeling about that one bad feeling about that one market house Mickey bat cookie okay uh, Maurice's Treats, Fantasyland Fruit Cart, and Lemonade on Small World Promenade. What is this? What kind of, what kind of mix is this? Look at that. Worms, mar marshmallows, pretzel. Uh, Trick or Treat with Gummy Worms. Okay. Mint Julep is going to have tangy apple Mickey shaped beignets dusted with tangy apple powder sugar tangy apple i think instead of calling it tangy they should have just called it green apple beignets like green apple beignets sounds amazing whatever whatever uh wow look at this cake they went hard on that Is there, is there too much food dye on this one, though? <laughs> All right, let's just keep going. Uh, Plaza Inn. Poison apple cake. Red cinnamon cake with cream cheese, caramelized apple filling, red cream cheese frosting, and green ganache. They're also going to have a, a chocolate shortcake and a chocolate silk cheesecake. Wow. Plaza Inn with the... With, with, with the uh, with the snacks, holy smokes! Popcorn near Haunted Mansion, Holland Halloween candy mix, popcorn chocolate covered pretzel. Uh, so it's gonna have popcorn with chocolate covered pretzels, candy corn, M and M's, uh, M and M peanut butter, chocolate candies, pretzel near Star Tours, a supernova jalapeno cheese filled pretzel. Uh, okay. I feel like they always have that, but sure. What are these? It's like a different style of churros. Rancho de Zocalo. They're going to have churro loops con cajeta. So we got some cajeta coming to Rancho de Zocalo. Uh, Mickey shaped pumpkin salted dulce cream puff. Damn. Rancho de Zocalo cream puffs are delicious. Uh, I do enjoy some some uh, some cream puffs over there. I've had I've had like two two versions, I think. That screams red teeth after eating. Yeah, <laughs> a lot of red stuff. Um, ice Mexican hot chocolate. What? Ooh, sounds good. Cantaloupe Agua Fresca. Some cantaloupe puree with lime juice. Okay. Okay. 
That sounds good. That sounds very good. Uh, Red Rose Tavern. Dude, I'm not even, like, close to finishing. Let me get a vibe check. E everybody's still awake. I know it's early. Everyone's drinking their coffees. Are we still awake? Are we good? Am I, am I boring you? <laughs> I just want to get a vibe check. Or, or is everybody enjoying this? Because <laughs> uh, for me personally, this is awesome. Uh, you know, usually I don't have time to do breakdowns like this. I'm just so busy. Life, a baby, trying to do stuff. So it's cool to like sit down and have the opportunity to break this down. I just want to get a vibe check. Where are we at? Where's everybody at? Sip my coffee. Oh, some good coffee today. My gosh. Trader Joe's. Yeah, why don't we have a Mickey Concha? Mickey shaped Concha. I don't know. It's a great idea. Joanna says, we're here in awake. Loving the new Halloween offerings. Okay, okay, okay. We good. Just making me hungry. <laughs> Five fires from Chico Theme Park. Rancho de Zocalo has some of the best foods during the holidays. Haven't uh, ever heard any of uh, Haven't never heard. Haven't ever had anything bad from there. Got it. There we go. Gosh. My English is struggling. Yeah, the cantaloupe thing. That, that sounds delicious. Like, they, they got some great drinks that are going to hit the spot on these hot days. Very awake. Close my office door to watch this part specifically. Okay, cool. Let me let me keep it going. I don't want to waste time then. Sounds like everybody's everybody's good. Thumbs up from Jess. Okay, we're good. We're good. Let me keep going. Let me keep going. What do we got here? Flatbreads. Whoa, what is that? Uh, sign me up for whatever this is. Uh huh. This is Red Rose Tavern. You already know this drink's about a suck right here. Prove me wrong, Red Rose Tavern. Prove me wrong. Uh, all right. Autumn Harvest Flatbread. Oh, roasted butternut squash puree. Roasted mushrooms. Plant-based feta. Roast, roasted diced butternut squash topped with garlic miso sauce and fried sage. So this one's a plant-based uh, autumn, the, the flatbread. Looks like very fall. Totally, totally Halloween vibe from that. Uh, Enchanted Pumpkin Stuff. Ooh, that's what that is. I, man, I haven't had a gray stuff in who knows how long. Not that it's bad. It's just, it's, 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 not, it's not a common thing to get. Uh, Enchanted Pumpkin Stuff. Pumpkin Mousse with Pumpkin Cake. Apricot Marmalade. Center top with green sprinkles, silver stars, chocolate branch, and leaf. Spicy chicken cordon boo. That's, that's, okay. Maple French toast sandwich. French toast with the egg patty, bacon, Munster cheese served with maple syrup. It doesn't even say new, so it's it's been here before. I don't recall that. But I, I don't eat at Red Rose uh, often, but I want to try that breakfast sandwich. Uh, I hope they sell that thing all day long. Uh, I, I love getting breakfast for dinner. Breakfast for dinner is one of my favorite things. It's, 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 it's a great thing. Uh, pumpkin Cheesecake Tavern Cold Brew. Yeah, I, I'm going to say stay away. Stay away from that. I, I, I don't recommend that just sounds like a stomach ache, and the last place you ever want a stomach ache is Disneyland. All right, refreshment corner. We got a new, we got a new, a new potato. Billy potato dog, baked potato topped with an all beef hot dog, thinly sliced beef, pepper, peppers, pepper, pepper, pepperoncini, pepperoncini, pepperon, pepperoncini. I just suck. I just suck at that word. <laughs> Peppercini, provolone, cherry spread. Um, sign me up. I've, I've had 
I had one of these already at Refreshment Corner. It was like the chili chili cheese dog one. Super good. I was shocked. It, it's like, it's just a, a mashed potato or, or just a baked potato goodness. So good. So freaking good. <sighs> what are these? Hot Cheeto. Embers con queso. Hot crunchy cheese curls with nacho cheese and jalapeno. I can already tell you right now, this this treat, this will be going viral. This is going to go viral on the TikToks, the Instagram reels, the Twitters. This is going to be a fan favorite right here. This is like just goodness. People already love this combo. They're just bringing it to Disneyland, I guess. <laughs> Embers con queso. Good name for that. Riverbell Terrace. Pumpkin Spice Pancakes. Wow, they've done it before. It doesn't say new. And Candy Bowl Pudding. Chocolate pudding with peanut butter chantilly and chocolate peanut butter pieces. All right, so Riverbell getting some new snacks. What do we got here? I'm just going to look at these pictures first. We got, we got these three, <laughs> these like balls. Uh, some type of cold brew, I'm guessing. What the heck? A strawberry beignet? Dude, look at that perfection. Nothing says Halloween like a Halloween funnel cake. That is a Halloween funnel cake right there. Damn. Royal Street Veranda. Pumpkin spice fritters. Warm pumpkin spice fritters served with cream cheese dipping. Pumpkin King Cold Brew. Brand new. Joffrey's Pumpkin Cream Brulee Cold Brew. Pumpkin Spice Creamer. Top toffee chips. And a Jack Skellington decor. I hope that's good. Creme Brulee Coffee? Damn. That's new to me. Stage Door Cafe. I do want to say something real quick. As, as of last week, Stage Door Cafe has been having some struggle with their like soda machines and stuff. So if you go to Stage Door Cafe, just be aware that like you might not be able to get soda or water or none of that. Uh, Disneyland needs to fix that. I don't, I don't know why they're doing, they're taking so long, but they got to fix that. That's going to be the Graveyard Banana Funnel Cake at Stage Door Cafe. Banana cream. Oh, my Atlanta. Tiana's Palace Strawberry Pie Filled Beignet. Strawberry cream filling topped with strawberry glaze. That's cool to see Tiana's Palace getting involved with the, with the Halloween. It's always nice. It's always nice. Um, what the heck is that? Whew, damn. <laughs> okay, okay. Tropical Hideaway, I see you. Uh, Untundu chicken. Fried chicken thighs. Shishito pepper. Harissa aioli. And lime wedge. That just has spicy as heck all over it. Shish Shishito peppers are good, but man, they, they got a kick. Monstropolis float. Ube dusted Dole Whip. Pineapple and mango with passion fruit, coconut juice, and lychee fruit. Wow. Perfect for a hot day right there. <laughs> I love how it's like eyeballs. It's, it's so cool. Um, Halloween. Okay, that's, that's it for Disneyland. Man. That that what a lineup. That that was just that was just Disneyland. Like that was not even we're not even in California Adventure. Wow. Dude. This is like foodie food, Disney foodies heaven right here. <laughs> they, they they just went hard. This is an incredible foodie guide. Okay. That's it for Disneyland. Let's hop on over to California Venture. Oh, uh, what do we got here? 
I'm guessing lots of alcohol. <laughs> now that we're at DCA. Aunt Cass Cafe. A taro bread pudding. Warm taro white chocolate bread pudding with whipped cream and boba pearls served with coconut vanilla sauce. We'll see. Maybe I try that one of these days. I don't know when I'll be in the mood for that, but um, award wiener. Brewery X Baja Breeze. Is it like Baja Blast, but a but a alcohol? Party beer IPA. Okay. Boardwalk Pizza and Pasta. Spicy Meats Pizza. Mango habanero sauce topped with pepperoni, spicy sausage, and chicken drizzled with ranch dressing. Oh my lanta! Wow, that that pizza is gonna that's gonna that's gonna burn that's gonna burn. <laughs> that's habanero on a pizza. Damn, cappuccino cart. Peanut butter cold brew. What? Chocolate and peanut butter infused cold brew. Top with a peanut butter cold foam. Drizzle and M&M's. Uh, geez. Peanut butter cold brew. Wow. Okay. Peanut butter cold brew cocktail. So, hey, we'll, we'll throw in some alcohol in there for 10 more bucks. Pumpkin Bunt Cake. we already seen that one before. Dang, look at that churro. What's up with that? It's like a witch's hat here. All right, all right. Damn, damn. Very interesting. This looks like, this looks like Cars Land stuff or something. Uh, churros at Hollywoodland. Matcha Chai Madness Churro. What? Why does Disney keep doing matcha churro? Get off the matcha. No more matcha churros. Just stop. Stop. I love matcha, but not on churros. Matcha and pistachio sugar-coated churro drizzle with chocolate sauce and top with almonds. So matcha pistachio. Clarabelle's hand scooped ice cream, a lava cake. Warm chocolate lava cake topped with scoop of vanilla ice cream, fresh berries and strawberry sauce. Candy corn float, Fanta orange with mango sorbet and whipped cream. Witch's Hat Sunday, mint chip ice cream with hot fudge and whipped cream, topped with the witch's hat. So all of the, these are Clarabelle items. Wow, I, I was thinking that was gonna be like some Cars Land stuff. All right, all right, we're good. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Um, churros at Hollywood Land. Uh, wow, did we already read that? Yeah, we already read that. Okay. Corn dog castle, spicy beef and mozzarella corn dog, drizzled with blackberry sauce, topped with pickle serranos, served with cuties mandarin or small bag of chips. I forgot corn dog castle existed. I haven't been there in a long time. Man, um, cozy cone. Here we go. Finally, I, I've been hoping, <laughs> waiting to read the Carsland stuff. Um, cozy cone motel. Peanut butter chocolate churro. Peanut butter sugar coated with churro. Uh, coated churro with peanut butter candy and chocolate sauce. All right. I'll try that. Fire truck slush. Strawberry slush with a hint of chili lime seasoning and lime. Strawberry slush margarita with a hint of chili lime seasoning and lime. Damn. There it is. Right? That's what it looks like. Cozy Cone Motel 2. Ice cream cone. 
Mater's Halloween Cone, Ube Soft Serve with Black Sprinkles Served in a Cup or Cone. Ube Vanilla Twist Soft Serve, Ube and Vanilla with Black Sprinkles. All right, so we got some Ube. So it sounds like a good new, uh, new addition to that one. Uh, Cozy Cone 3, Chili Cone Queso, the Slow Burning Mac and Cheese. People love, they love this thing. I've had, I've had it like once. And I thought it was just too much. Too much garbage going on. Carbaload right there. Um, Cozy Cone 4. Cozy Cone Motel 4. Look at this. Wow. Is that, is that like jalapenos? Damn, they're going with the spice. They're trying to spice it up. Four by S'more Mule. Toasted marshmallow mule with cinnamon whiskey. Cucumber jalapeno lemonade. Cucumber jalapeno margarita. And then they're also going to get some a whole lot of new beers. Look at that. Just beer. It's a, a party beer. Cucumber. Cucumber Sour Cucumber Jalapeno Beer Cocktail. <laughs> Jeez Louise. <laughs> I, 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 don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't understand how they do so many cool stuff at Cozy Cone Motel. It's so small in there, but they, they pack a punch. They pack a punch. All right, let's keep going. Let's keep going. Uh, wow, more Cozy Cone, damn. Cozy Cone 5, Popcorn Scoop. Cozy Cone Buttered Corn on the Cob with Spicy Lime Mayo, rolled in your choice of cojeta or Spice Crushed Chili Cheese Puffs. I've had both of these, and uh, they just hit the spot. These things are freaking fire. I, I recommend both of these. Probably this one more, but... They're both good. Um, Flows V8. Uh, mango habanero chicken strips. I don't, I don't know why they're bringing that back. I, I feel like people didn't like those last year. But that's just that's just what I remember. Uh, Seaborn chili mango margarita. Okay. Damn. Alcohol. Dude. It, it just D, it's Disney California... Alcohol. It's not even an adventure. It's Disney California alcohol. <laughs> it's just alcohol on alcohol. Hollywood Lounge. Asian inspired spicy pork tacos. Oh, damn. Kimchi, cucumber, carrots, pickled onions with sriracha aioli on a flour tortilla. Definitely trying that. That sounds great. Cucumber mint lemonade. Mystical mandarin margarita. A Dreadful Dragon Fruit Margarita. Spooky Spicy Pineapple Margarita. Dude. Wow. Margarita upon margaritas. Hollywood Lounge always goes hard. It's always a great spot. I'm just throwing it out there. I'm just throwing it out there. Um, I've been seeing less and less people buying alcohol at Hollywood Lounge. You know, you go back. Like, I just, I always remember, like, 2017, 2018, 2019, Hollywood, La Hollywood Lounge, everybody just drinking, so much drink going on, and when I look at, like, my last Disney trip, which we're in summer, you know, it's kind of busy, even though it was, a, it was a hot day, Hollywood Lounge was empty, I was like, wow, people... And then you look at the prices, and it's like, well, that probably has a lot to do with it. Like right here, this is like five hundred dollars in the screen right now. <laughs> I'm just kidding. These are all probably like fifteen to twenty dollars. I'm guessing. The beers are like in the twelve, thirteen, but the anytime there's like tequila, margarita, you know, the eighteen dollars, eighteen to twenty five. All right, what is that? Wow. Is that like hot Cheetos or something? Damn. D D Disneyland Resort's like, if it's Halloween time, 
we're going to make everything spicy. <laughs> I don't know why Halloween, everything has to be spicy, but okay, I get it. Sure. Um, Jack Jack Cookie Num Nums. A monster baby cookie's coming back. That one we've had before. Lamplight. Boardwalk Dining. Moonster Ink Sliders. They had this before? It doesn't even say new. Smash Burger Patty, Moonster Cheese, Anaheim Chili, House Chipotle Sauce, Candy Bacon, House Pickle, Crispy Onions, Peppered in a Brioche Bun Served with House Kettle Chips. Damn, that is a lot of ingredients in that Moonster Slider. Halloween Cocktail, Frangelico, Orange Juice, Vanilla Vodka, Butterscotch Syrup, a long or a almond or geet syrup and angostura bitters. Whew. Looks good. I would try that. I'd try that. Lamplight Lounge. Pumpkin spiced latte donuts. They're also gonna have the Halloween cocktail. A bevoke cat's paw cider. And um, Ame Gang Imperial Peanut Butter Stout. Damn. I would try that. Peanut Butter Stout. Wow. All this, there's a lot of peanut butter infused stuff this year. We, we, we keep seeing peanut butter. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, Mortimer's Market is going to have Vampire Mickey Bread. Uh, Poultry Palace. Oh, Poultry Palace finally getting something new. That's over there in Pixar Pier. Chipotle Chicken Drumstick Box. Ooh. I would try that. Why not? Sonoma Terrace. And I don't even know how to say that. Oktoberfest Martin Lager. And then Senior Buzz Churro. Poison apple churro, green cinnamon sugar, with Granny Smith apple icing. Wow. <laughs> That's very Halloween-y right there. <laughs> Damn. Great foodie guide so far. My goodness. What? Look at that. I never got one of those. First... I think, I know, I remember in the article they were saying it, it came back. I, I never got one of those. That's cool. Very cool. Are they selling Mickey waffles? What? Schmoozies. Ursula Shake. Coconut and Taro Shake with whip top. And cotton candy dusted blue sugar. Mickey Mouse Mummy Shake. Chocolate Shake with whipped topping. Chocolate cream filled cookies. Okay. Just a chocolate shake. Mickey Shape Waffles with maple syrup. Yeah. They're finally selling Mickey Waffles in the park. That's big news. You only get Mickey Waffles if you do character dining, I guess. I, where else can I get Mickey Waffles? Pretty much character dining. That's like I like in my mind, I equate Mickey Waffles to character character dining. Um, maybe Carnation Cafe sells like one big Mickey Waffle, but th this looks like multiple Mickey Waffles. I guess two two Mickey Waffles for six dollars, <laughs> or however much they're gonna cost. That's a smoothies. Wow. Pumpkin espresso martini with caramel vodka. Ah, oh, so martini with vodka right there. Okay. Yeah, that Ursula drink, that's just like perfection. I, I don't know if that's good or not, but it looks great. Um smoke jumper grill villainous double cheeseburger double cheeseburger with pepper jack chili peppers arugula spicy aioli 
served with crinkle cut fries. That sounds delicious. Absolutely delicious. Look at all that onion and stuff. Oh, that looks great. Uh, Oogie Boogie Apple Lemonade. I've had that. It's delicious. Very sugary, but it's delicious. Uh, and they could even add alcohol. They put some vodka in that drink for you. <laughs> Ten more dollars, please. Studio Catering Company. Asian-inspired spicy pork tacos. Wow. Kimchi, cucumber, carrot, pickled onion, sriracha, aioli on the... I remember we read that earlier. Now we get a picture of it. Yeah, that looks great. Definitely want to try that. Cucumber mint lemonade. Cucumber mint. Wow. Yeah, waffles in the park, right? That's a big deal. I I don't re recall like the the little waffles. That's so good. That's a good move. Very good move. Let's see. Hold on, I'm just reading. <laughs> okay, okay. You know, as I'm reading through this, you know, I'm, I'm always checking uh, Instagram and Twitter for, like, updates and stuff. I was just reading on Twitter right now because uh, <laughs> the, the, the slowdown at the United State parks is because low income stress. That, that Disney cited that, like, that low income stress is one of the reasons that they're seeing a slowdown at the parks. Why it's just wild to read that. All right, let's keep going. Let's keep going. Willie's churro, pumpkin spice churro drizzled with cream cheese icing and topped with graham cracker cereal. Probably the best churro this year, right here. That looks amazing. Wine Country Tutoria pumpkin tiramisu. Okay, I didn't know they were. I didn't even know they had tiramisu. That, that's that. It doesn't even say new, so it's been there. Um. Look at that. Does that look good or what? <laughs> look at that. That that that's like probably twenty two dollars right there. <laughs> what tamales? Where are these tamales going? Select outdoor vending location. Ghost pepper turkey leg. Brand new garlic cream cheese bread, red beef tamale with malcajeta salsa, malcajeta, green chili and cheese tamale with tomatillo salsa, and then a cotton, a, a candy apple cotton candy, candy apple cotton candy, a candy apple mimosa. And they're also going to have a Seaborn Baja Lime Margarita. Wow. I'm guessing this is all, like, located by uh, Goofy Sky School, you know, down that way. That, that's that's the feel I get from this. Because <laughs> they just listed it as, like, outdoor vending location. So that, that's what I'm assuming. Um, that's it. That's it for DCA. Wow. So, to me, it looks like the foodie guide is predominantly being, it's Disneyland. Uh, DCA, I, I was expecting a lot more. You know, that is where Oogie Boogie Bash is going to be. Maybe maybe they put some Oogie Boogie Bash foods in here. We'll see. Uh, Disney, Halloween snacks at the hotel. This is Trader Sam's right here? What? Trader Sam's. Spice Spider Eye Punch. 
Spider Eye Punch. A Pina Gulata. Ooh. <laughs> Look at all these. Yeah, this is too many, too many ingredients to go over with these alcohol. Scarecrow Old Fashioned. So you could get a Spider Eye Punch, Pina Gulata, or a Scarecrow Old Fashioned. Dude, take me. Take me to Trader Sam's, please. Wow. That's cool. Uh, coffee House. We don't really care. Goofy's Kitchen is going to celebrate with Halloween outfits and stuff. Oh, they, they're, they're giving us Goofy Kitchen. Okay, okay. I didn't know they were going to give us the menu. Uh, they're going to have Blackberry Ginger Soda. Black Orange Spritz. Maple Apple Hot Toddy. Oh, these are just like drinks, I guess. Wow. Damn. It's like everything after Disneyland is like alcohol. <laughs> Not a bad thing. It's just, it's just, it's just like, damn. The Grand Californian Hearthstone Lounge is gonna have Dark Comes the Night, a Buffalo Trace Kentucky Straight Bourbon Whiskey. That's a brand new item. Halloween Espresso Martini. Ooh, I love me espresso martini. Flor de Caña Espresso Coffee Liqueur and Flor de Caña Echo 15-Year Rum. That's at the Grand Californian when you're at the lobby or uh, you just go to Hearthstone. Craftsman's Grill is also going to have these alcohol. Craftsman's or Craftsman's Bar, I mean. Uh... Oogie Boogie Cookie, Gingerbread Cookie. I'm just trying to see, like, something to spot. Um, don't forget, too, Storyteller Cafe is going to have a new Mickey's Autumn Adventures at Storyteller Cafe. Brand new outfits. Lots of cool decor is going to be going on there, so that's going to be a lot of fun this year. We hit 200 likes. Thank you so much, everybody. Let's go. Hell yeah. Thank you, everybody, for smashing the like button. Um, what do we got here? Pixar Place Hotel. What? The Sketchpad Cafe. I still have yet to eat there. I, I, need to, I need to make my way out there one of these days. Pumpkin Cheesecake Overnight Oats topped with granola dried cranberries and gummy worms. Salted caramel whoopie pie with dark cocoa powder and layered with salted caramel buttercream. And then a pumpkin cold brew. So all the people staying at Pixar Place Hotel, you got some new items arriving for Halloween season. All right, that's a nice little start to the day. Um... Black Bat Mini Cake. A cake pop. Black Bat Mini Cake Pop. So that's coming soon. A Lotso Cake Pop is coming. Why no photos? I want some photos of this stuff. Skeleton Mini Apple. Okay. Scare Car Apple. And then a Llama Poison Cereal Treat. So lots of cool treats coming soon. Uh, these are just returning. I don't know how many two new treats they're going to have. It doesn't seem like too many new, but hey, these are as Halloween as it gets. So why not? Why not? What is this? Downtown Disney. 
Okay. Look at Splitsville getting involved. Damn. All right, let's end it with the novelties. So we got a brand new sipper. Look at that. So adorable. I have a feeling that was supposed to come last year because di didn't Mickey look like that last year? <laughs> but hey, better late than never. Um, we also got like a glow cube. We've had those before, I'm pretty sure. But that sipper, that's going to be very popular. Uh, and then... A nut. Look at this zipper. Oh, my Lanta. Uh, that'll probably be sold out. Wow. That's cool. I don't know if I saw this. I think my first time seeing that. I don't, rec I don't remember seeing that earlier. What is this? A con Cusco Cusco's Poison Bottle Glow Cube. Ah, it's a glow cube. You got a new popcorn bucket right there. A new new mug, I guess. I don't even know what to call it. Mug. Tumbler. New drink topper. Then like a straw a straw clip right here. That light up. Look at this. It's so cute. And then, yeah, that this is the main event right here. That's pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. I I I don't need this thing, but I need myself a, a Mater Vampire. I need myself a Mater Vampire bucket right now. Yeah, that's a great that's a great popcorn bucket. Per, it, it's literally perfection, honestly. <sighs> wow, Mickey looked like that two years ago. I know. I was like, he looked like that recently. I just I don't remember when. Um, okay, we got some light up thing. Zoogie boogie. I don't think none of that is new for Oogie Boogie. Hmm. No, 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 nothing much to say with Oogie Boogie. Um, just for the people that are going to Oogie Boogie, I just want to throw it out there. It is expensive, but I know people love doing it. Uh, they have like a frightfully fun dessert package. Is that what they call it? Oogie Boogie Bash Dessert Package. And uh, you get a great view. You get to sit down while you watch the parade for Oogie Boogie. Get some desserts. If I'm not mistaken, it's like another 60 bucks maybe or something. Something like that. 45 to 60. I can't remember. But uh, people always, they always say great things about it. They always say great things. Um, 